Thanks guys, Erica Bloomberg here with your top 5 ideas on what to do on a spring break staycation. Although the weather has been warming up, it hasn't yet reached beach going temperatures. If you find yourself sitting at home with cool temperatures keeping you from going to the beach, try using a hotel's indoor pool. They may charge a day fee to use their pool area, however this will certainly be cheaper than actually staying at the hotel for a night. Many colleges have different weeks for spring break. If none of your old friends from high school are off the same week as you, Try going up and visiting them at school. This is a great way to catch up and see exactly what they've been up to since you last saw them. During spring break, it's easy to just sit at home and scroll through social media sites such as Facebook or Instagram. To help avoid this, try taking a day or short overnight trip. A quick trip into the city is certainly cheaper than a week-long vacation to Cancun or the Bahamas. This next idea may be a little on the pricey side, but the cost will certainly be worth it. Going into a spa for a quick facial or hour-long massage is the perfect way to get your stress levels down from school. Maybe even meet up with a, a few friends for a relaxing afternoon of group massages followed by a night out. Lastly, what better way to spend your spring break than giving back to your community? This is by far the cheapest spring break option as it won't cost you a dime. In return, you'll be more productive than if you had just sat at home and watched Netflix. You might also be able to add it to your resume. Well, that's all I have for you today. Enjoy your spring break, and we'll be right back with more of the morning after, after this quick commercial break.